last night. You were unhinged. You were like some desperate, howling demon. You frightened me. Do it again. Dang, you're a handful. I should have bought black curtains. Black is so much more cheerful. It's now. tiring day. I think I'll go down and relax a bit on the nail bed. Yeah. <laughs> Darling, you think of everything. You have placed Fester under some strange sexual spell. I respect that. You have gone too far. You have destroyed his spirit. You have taken him from us. All that I could forgive. But Debbie... What? Pastels? Darling, you <laughs> remembered. How could I forget our 13th anniversary? It started on the stroke of midnight. <laughs> oh, I'm so excited I can't get it open. <laughs> oh, thank you, thing. <laughs> Oh, darling, what a sensible gift. A bat net. Get it. It's a nightgown. Oh? Lace. For our 13th. Oh, darling, it's beautiful. And my favorite color, too. Black. <laughs> Look. Our little boy. All tuckered out. It's so sweet. He looks just like a little entree. Good morning, my dear. You seem quite happy. I am, darling. My thorns came in so nice and pointy this year. Oh, they talk about green thumbs. You've got a red thumb. Children, what are you doing? I'm going to electrocute him. But we're late for the charity auction. But, Mother... I said no. Please? Oh, all right. Would you uh, like to join us in the garden? Could we dig some graves for my dolls? <laughs> this one's name's Anne Boleyn. <laughs> my favorite person in history is Ivan the Terrible. Oh, he was sweet. Oh, Tish, what more could we ask? Gomez. Caramia. Marvelous news. I'm going to have a baby. Right now. Are you in unbearable pain? Is it inhuman? My darling, is it torture? Oui. Mon oh. cher. Mrs. Adams, the baby? Pardon. Push, Mrs. Adams. My father's eyes. Gomez, take those out of his mouth. Oh, and Lurch, do try to be a little friendly. Let her see that charming leer of yours. <laughs> Midnight, moonlight, surrounded by death. It's been too long. Do it. Hold him still. <laughs> you missed. One house, three children. So many windows. My darling, it's you I'm worried about, the stress. Oh, I'll be fine. I'm just like any modern woman, trying to have it all. A loving husband, a family. It's just I wish I had more time to seek out the dark forces and join their hellish crusade. That's all. We'll be delighted. Oh, yes, we know the house. The one that... Well, it does look sort of haunted. <laughs> Why, thank you. We have so many homemakers re-entering the workforce. Uh, college? Private tutors. Major? Spells and hexes. Liberal arts. Come on, kitty cat. Oh, oh you're 
you're so stubborn. <laughs> Ms. Adams. I'm Morticia Frum. That's my pet pet. <laughs> I like cats. What's in there? My plant. Plant in there? Oh, she bites. <laughs> Her name is Cleopatra. And this is my doll. Her name's Marie Antoinette. I chopped off her head. <laughs> Uncle Knickknack's winter wardrobe. Uncle Knickknack's summer wardrobe. Uncle Knickknack. Now, lemon, cream, or Sacred. <laughs> Tighter. You've done this before. Not so hard, dear. He's tall enough already. Sorry, my love. I don't know my own strength. He's turning a beautiful shade of red. It's more magenta. Very popular color this year. Well... Better give it another go. Our whole family, together at last. Three generations, above ground. What strange plants. Well, they're really not at their best. I think they need some more hamburger. Hamburger? Their favorite food. I wonder if it would be good for my daisies. I wouldn't know. I've never raised... Daisies. <laughs> How long has it been since we've waltzed? Oh, Gomez. Hours. met was an evening much like this. Magic in the air. A boy. A girl. An open grave. It was my first funeral. You were so beautiful. Pale and mysterious. No one even looked at the corpse. Your cousin Balthazar 
You are still a suspect. Someday we'll be buried here, side by side, six feet under, in matching coffins, our lifeless bodies rotting together for all eternity.